our free time, our free love, our free care continues to the backbone of the economy. Oh, wait, and free products, free products around the world. This is where the socialist feminist theory of waiter for house story comes in. What is stolen from us and positioned as free? The free market was conceptualized by Adam Smith in his text, The Wealth of Nations, during the 18th century negotiation of industrialism and capitalism. Though the modern state emerged to mediate privatization of property, this free market concept encouraged the removal of the state from economic intervention altogether. Have you heard of laissez-faire economics? The laissez-faire free market concept became part in economic philosophy almost four centuries after the violent theft of life and land by European colonizers in Africa and the contemporary landmass known today as the Americas. This leaves us quest with questions over the interpretation of the word free by said economists within a colonial context. So, what's free? So, this is, is it free? free? <laughs> is that free? This is free. The aggressive privatization of land and the enslavement of bodies went hand in hand with influencing the formation of Marxist thought. Black Marxism is an economic concept developed by Cedric Robinson and organizations such as the Black Panther Party and Critical Resistance, the New Red Order, ask settlers to give it back. Give it back. The mass accumulation of land and lording over said land forces people into positions where they must make and sell unnecessary goods to siphon money upwards. Landlords hold the land over the workers' heads. Land and access to it as a resource is at the core of all conflicts playing out across the globe. How do we pay rent on stolen land? Or what does it mean to pay rent on unceded territory? Land doesn't have to be where lived on, shared, communally accessed. No one has a right to live on this earth more than any other. The enclosure of land and bodies in prisons remain connected to historical legacies of capitalist ideology. The obscuring of the word free, free man, free market, Within systems of privatization, accumulation, and state power genocide continue. What is so different about product looting during riots, 99% discounts during Black Friday, and the boxes of promotional product influences get shipped to their houses? Does everyone want everything free because everyone wants to be free? Free from the pain of labor? Free from guilt? Free goods normalize the land and labor theft upon which the free market is built. Free goods are part of the market's operations of supply and demand. In this case, we are displaying stolen product as a critique of the word free. Let the fact that it was stolen ring out everywhere to remind us of the reality of working conditions. The security tag represents the security tag represents the domestication of literally everything. Often used on cattle, on Virgil's off-white Nike collab on refugees and ice camps in Palestine. Sensors are artifacts that reflect and enforce the accumulation and construction of the indoors and the outdoors. Of states, it represents the growing price of our oppression. Security tags are removed upon the ritual of payment and the departure from the indoors. The border between payment and theft is mediated by the tag that marks the uncensored and censored body. Question being invited inside but only at a cost. Question trying to leave, but at the cost of your life. Rest in peace, Bay go brown, say his name. Imagine freedom. Imagine the return of land to freedom with the recognition of whom it was stolen from. Imagine the depavement of the land, the regeneration of urban space, the skateboarding plazas with no rules. Please imagine a better world. I never dream of having my own store. I dream of groups people and multicolored coats outdoors with 700 goose down feel so warm they would never need to go inside no matter the weather resisting domestication screaming amor de rey unifying in gangs giving each other hugs staying off drugs and holding down their, our neighborhoods the american dream is not mine that fallacy is actually my waking nightmare i dream of nothing more than freedom for all oppressed people Equality, e equity instead of a misguided equality. The right of people to move freely, unencumbered of man-made borders and lines of division. The right of all people to have bodily autonomy. I dream of a world where empathy is practiced, where people work not for wages or merits, but for the love of one another. 
Well, self-care is extended past the ego to honor the self that we see in others. Wages for housework, services, not surveillance, rule for house, world syndicate, love and guard, giving back, 